birthday. We're visiting here today with Brother Martin pitcher Corey Giacconi, and we're discussing the Crusaders' 3 1 victory against Holy Cross. Corey, I want to start with uh, you had a uh, uh, key role today coming in in relief of uh, Luke Bernard and shutting this down to preserve this victory. Uh, you've been a four year starter and a four year starter as a starter. What was it like today to uh, be thrust into a reliever's role? Yeah, well, I mean, uh, it was a little bit different than normal, not starting, but I mean, same process really, go through your same routine. And uh, Luke did a great job out there, holding him only one run. So, I mean, I don't want to let him down or the team down. So I just came in and uh, do what I know to do and just pitch, throw strikes, and uh, let my defense play behind me. Um, I know you, you mentioned a little earlier, out nearly three weeks, two and a half weeks, uh, no ring rust, didn't look like uh, it. I mean, I don't know, I wouldn't say I'm uh, completely, completely there all the way. I mean, it was a little bit of rust, but uh, I mean, I just came out through strikes and uh, it was gr definitely great to be back after that uh, time off. Put some perspective on uh, what this win means for you guys. It may not come in time to to, uh, to, to get you a district championship, but certainly I know you guys have an eye towards the postseason. Oh uh, yeah, I mean it was a uh, definitely a quality win against a quality team, and uh, I mean really a good win to go into uh, last game of the season against Jesuit in two days, and uh, you really want to go into playoffs with uh, with a winning streak and you know playing your best ball you've been playing all year and going at that high. So, I mean, it was real good for our team, and hopefully we can uh, carry it on and just bring it to the uh, playoffs.